I was in insurance, I was sitting at a desk all day, I wanted something different. Um, I wanted to help people. So one of the ways I could help people is by being a manager, by helping the teenagers who start here because most of them it's their first job. So when they come here, it's we're teaching them life lessons, what to bring into their workforce going forward. And building their resumes is our number one priority when it comes to what we're showing them. And But with that, it's not just about work, it's about building relationships for when they're adults as well. So if they had school outings, if they had plays, if they had football games, um, we would attend. We would all try and support as much as we can. Obviously we're open or we're open seven days a week. So it was hard for everyone to be there, but we did our absolute best to ensure that someone from the theater was always there representing them to support them. The Ford is special to me in many ways, but business-wise, what makes it so special to me is the relationships. Um, it's, it's not necessarily a competition amongst business owners or managers. It's how can we work together and collaborate to make everybody successful and that is something that I haven't really experienced before, so it's super special to me. COVID shut our doors. There's no going around that. We had to improvise. We came up with, you know, delivering popcorn, which we didn't know how that was gonna go over because it's popcorn, uh, but it went really well. People loved it, they enjoyed it. Um, you know, we, we were closed for a long time. We didn't reopen until August and we had some private screenings or special event screenings, sponsored movies that we raised money for charity in the month of July. Although those were super successful, it's still not as busy as it was pre-COVID. So there's still a long way for us to go before we're back to where we were. All of us at the theater have been trained to disinfect properly, to take care of you know, high touch areas, bathrooms, we're wearing masks. We also disinfect the seats, which we did before, but we're amping it up a little bit more and we're just doing everything we possibly can to keep everyone safe. Something we've implemented for COVID um, is private screenings. So a lot of people come, they, or they don't feel comfortable coming yet. We have the option now that because we're not open seven days a week, we can offer private screenings. They bring in a Blu-ray, we pop it in, they have up to 13 guests. Um, of their choice, whether it's in their cohort or not. Um, and they watch the movie. They get the whole theater to themselves. It's safe. No one else is in there they have to worry about. And it's been a hit. We've had so many private screenings since they started. People can support us by coming, by trusting us, by realizing that we are doing everything. We're not just saying it, we're doing everything we can to keep you and ourselves safe. We treat everyone like they're our best friends. It's not just about the customer. It's like, we're not treating you like a number or anything like that. We're gonna remember your order. If you're a regular, we're gonna know your name. We have amazing luxury recliner seats. We sell booze, which is all um, local or near to local. Um, so we have Fort Distillery, cocktails, we have Alley Cat beer, and uh, yeah, you're always going to get a smile and amazing service when you come here. <laughs>